All new here at 11, the CDC says black women are three times more likely to die from pregnancy related issues than white women. The Christ Hospital wants to change that. WCPO 9 News reporter Jessica Hart talks with one woman who is grateful she didn't become another statistic. Candace Walters holds her baby tight. She's doing so good. <laughs> because these are moments she almost didn't have. I just woke up and I felt this immense like pressure. I wasn't sure, you know, what it was, but I just knew it wasn't normal. So she called her doctor who told her to go to the ER. Things just didn't look like regular preeclampsia or textbook preeclampsia for Candace. And so that's when we um, involved our cardiology team and evaluated her and realized that she'd had a um, coronary dissection. That's when the coronary arterial wall separates, which can lead to death. All of these people came rushing in. I knew it had to be something serious. This all happened nine days after she gave birth, so her doctor, Kimberly Russell, was on high alert. Women of color and black women in particular have um, a threefold increased risk of maternal mortality compared to their white counterparts. Russell says racial disparities in healthcare can lead to some women not communicating with their doctor. It's a multifactorial problem that we see with that discrepancy of care, um, starting anywhere from implicit bias in the healthcare system to individual systems. One way Christ Hospital is tackling this issue is by seeing mothers earlier after delivery, conducting more screening tests, and continuing to see them up to a year after they gave birth. So we're hoping to not let women fall through the cracks. As a woman and a woman of color, we have to advocate for our health. Walter says she's grateful Dr. Russell was there to catch her so she can enjoy more precious moments with her family. Walters just completed cardiology rehab. Dr. Russell says it's crucial for women of color to ask questions and advocate for themselves by speaking up or bringing a friend along. Walter hopes her story will encourage other black women to take care of themselves.